According to the IPCC, we need immediate global actions if we want to avoid global temperatures from rising above 1.5 degree, which is something that we need to avoid at all costs. The recent Australian bushfires illustrated how devastating the impacts of climate change can be. But if we hit 1.5 degree, things are going to get a lot worse. Imagine 70 to 90% of all coral in the world gone. But how will climate change affect the places where Australians actually live, work and play every single day? Well, that's exactly the question that I'm trying to address with my research. More than 80% of Australians live around an estuary where the river meets the ocean. But how are these places going to look like in 50 years from now? Using satellite data, modeling and field campaigns, my research tries to predict the future of our estuaries by bringing down global projections of climate change to a scale that's relevant for our daily lives, such as individual rivers, ecosystems or species. Sea levels are expected to rise by around a meter by the end of the century, possibly even two. Ocean temperatures right here are rising at global record rates and rainfall patterns are changing. So whether you're a surfer looking for the perfect wave or a businessman catching the ferry to work. My research helps to better understand just how and when we will be impacted right here. But to stay below 1.5 degree requires immediate global actions by you, me, 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 me. And everyone. It's about protecting our way of life, our planet, and all the amazing species that we share with.